And the Wildcats are taking the field. Both teams are ready for football, and so are we. It is the wrap-up to week three, the D.C. Defenders and the Los Angeles Wildcats. Working out of the shotgun on second down. Johnson over the middle of the field, and the tight end, Brandon Barnes, makes the catch right at midfield. And that's a first down, 40. Johnson again going deep. This time, McBride's open into the end zone for the Wildcat touchdown. Converting almost at the same exact rate as the two-yard. Oh, and he just missed Bruce. Trey McBride, he began the year with D.C. Yeah, I mean, what a great job. Just a simple play action. McBride starts off to the left, and he just runs what they call a bomb seven. It looks like he's going to run an over out. He sticks his foot in the ground, and he takes his angle high. You'll see McBride inside release. Looks like an over out, and just Lawrence falls down on the second reaction move. McBride makes the play, and he's able to jump across for the... Chaos yeah, just on the wrong side. Jones in the shadows. Oh, that one's picked off. Arion Springs with the interception. And we didn't even get to the fact that this L.A. Wildcat defense comes in last against the pass, missing their starting two cornerbacks. But so what? Arion Springs steps in and gets the interception. Yeah, you'll see, they just try to, they just, they run a sprint out. You got a speed out by the outside guy, and they try to run a corner, and Springs does a great job playing both guys. What the offense is trying to do there is they're trying, to, if he gets too much depth, we throw it to the underneath guy. If he jumps the underneath guy, we're going to throw it over his head. Springs played right between the two. Cardale kind of threw that ball off balance, and the game unfolds. And they haven't done it thus far. Still early, but we will see as Cardale Jones. That was picked off. Mike Stevens with the interception. These two backup corners starting today already each have a pick in the first quarter. Yeah, and again, it just doesn't seem at the top of his of his drop that Cardell has a lot of confidence and feels clear about where to go with the ball. You know, you see him here, he kind of double clutches. We're going to get a great view here of kind of what he sees. You know, you see him kind of double pat and double pat, and he tries to bring his receiver away from that Mike linebacker. So 57 is the cover two dropper, and the nickel here, Stevens, he's what they call it poaching. He's poaching the inside two receivers, reading the quarterback's eyes. And Johnson, all kinds of time. Underneath and open, caught Martez Carter, first and goal. And they hand it off to one of them, Larry Rose. Lowers his shoulder into the end zone for the score. Well, there was no mistake what L.A. wanted to do. They, they felt that they could run the ball right at him, as you said. Two running backs, seven offensive linemen, and a great job by Rose. You know, they 33% they of their targets this year. Big Here comes the pressure. Him going. Screen play. Carter. Got it. Hurry, hurry, let's go. Jones under pressure, set. Another big play by this Wildcats defense, Trey Williams with the sack. Gets it off cleanly. Here's Kermit Whitfield, backing up. Now going forward down the sideline, he thought about it. Reversing field, there's room to that left side if he can get there. With a block. Into D.C. territory by Whitfield. Gives him the ball at the DC 42. Here's Johnson with time. Middle of the field. Off the fingertips of Trey McBride. Oh, McBride has him beat. Would have been his second touchdown of the game. What a great ball. Just a big deep post route by McBride. Gets a clean release. Runs right by the safety and corner just kind of short arms it. He didn't fully extend for the ball. You see how his elbows are bent. 32-yard line here to keep the drive going. McBride does it in all the XFL. Here's Josh Johnson going deep down the sideline. This time, Trey McBride hauls it in. He wasn't going to let that opportunity pass him up. 
you knew he was kicking himself from the earlier drop on what would have been his second touchdown, and Josh Johnson comes back to him again. This time, nothing fancy. He just runs a go route on the outside, runs right by. Again, remember, that's good coaching. Remember, Lawrence just came out of the game, and now he's replaced by his backup, Duran Grant. And he just runs right by him. That's great coaching. By hurry, hurry! Yo. Play fake. Jones wants to go downfield, but can't. Pulls it down, runs with it. Oh, it's blocked. And L.A. recovers inside the five. Jack Tocho. Offense, defense, special team. Yep. This is just an all-around unbelievable effort. He got there so fast, the punter pulled the ball back. Yeah. He didn't even attempt to punt it. It's not often that you see that. Seven linemen again. Carter trying to dive into the end zone, and he got it. Martez Carter, his second rushing touchdown of the game. This has to feel so good for these guys. Everything, the last, how the first two weeks went. Again, that scissors action. See, see Scooby, oh, he lost the ball. I guess they're saying he broke the plane. Yeah. So go. Now for the one point. And they get it again. Into the halftime break. Here's Jones over the middle, caught his tight end, Kari and Lee, and Lee will take it down to the 20. Here's Ty Rasa. We'll try this one from 32 yards out. And DC gets three points. Yo. Terrell Presley gets it outside, gets the first down and more. Ditch. Here comes the blitz. Cardell gets it off and it is caught. They fake the draw. Jones looking down the right side. Jack Tocho with the interception. Just another example. Cardell just kind of forcing that ball, trying to get it all on one throw. Third and 17, just forcing that ball. Fourth. Johnson has time. Caught. Big hit afterwards, and Trey McBride is still down. Yeah, he took a good shot there. Shot from Jamarco Thomas. And now they threw a late flag. Posture, I do feel this is a foul. 15-yard penalty, automatic first down. And that's exactly what they call, Dean. Hitting a defenseless player, Jamarco Thomas. To go! Out of the backfield. Carter with blocks. This time, he delivered. They fake the draw, and Jones is in trouble. Devin Taylor this time brings him down. The defenders. On fourth down, Jones intercepted again. His fourth pick thrown. Mike Stevens, his second interception of the game, and he's going down the sideline with help. Flags come flying out as he's down in D.C. territory. They're in a heavy run situation here. Third in the yard. Oh, they get that and more. Martez Carter going in for his third touchdown of the game. There's the backflip. Mr. Excitement. This is awesome. I mean, what an unbelievable, I mean, taking the most out of your opportunities. We talked about Elijah Hood, their starter, had some struggles the first two weeks. Carter's now getting his, his chance, and God, is he making the most of it. This L.A. offense looks light years different from what we've seen in the first two weeks. Brissett, first down and more. Still on his feet, and the defense.
this game is now over 44 and a half points. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Anybody who is sweating the over now can take a deep breath. Again, they've run this play a few times now. They're going to pull the backside offensive line, and you see just a single back gap type scheme. And really, Brissett just kind of does the, the back end kind of by himself, made the safety miss. Coach Moss said that he really worked them extra this week. They had every reason to come out here and quit, but obviously you saw it was the complete opposite. And today they were able to get all those things accomplished. And so Pep Hamilton goes down in defeat for the first time as a head coach at any level, while Winston Moss gets his first win as a head coach at any level.